Welcome back once again, all of my low carb friends. And for those of you who are here for the first time, welcome. Today, I have another two for one review slash recipe video for you. A few weeks ago, a company called Rock Your Walk contacted me and asked me if I would like to review some of their cookware. And of course I said yes because I'm all about trying new things and helping you guys get the best deals for your money. Rocky Walk is an Amazon only store that specifically sells eco-friendly cookware sets. This was perfect for me because I have been on the lookout for some new skillet sets because mine are looking a little sad. So this was great because that is exactly what they said they were going to send me was a eco-friendly skillet set. So this was great and I am hoping, hoping, hoping that they are a good product. The link to this product as well as a 15% discount code will be of course in the description. But before we get into the review, keep in mind that if you want to continue to see good reviews and many, many, many delicious, easy, low carb keto recipes, make sure you click the subscribe button and click the notification bell that's right next to the subscribe button. That way you don't miss out on any of my videos. And while we do all that, let's see what these skillets are all about. Okay, so here is the huge box that the skillets, or as they call them, frying pans came in. So let's open this bad boy up. Inside the big box, we have a smaller box. This box has the company's name on it, Rock Your Walk. Kind of like that name, Rock Your Walk. This is what's supposed to be in there, an 8-inch, 10-inch, and 12-inch white frying pan, or as I call them, skillets. These are eco-friendly, made with 100% recycled aluminum. On their website, it also says that they have cast steel in them. These have an inorganic ceramic coating on the outside. The coating is supposed to be non-stick and free from any toxic chemicals or lead, which is really good because you don't want those nasty things leaking into your food when you're cooking. These are supposed to be long-lasting, non-stick, and easy to clean up. So that sounds good. Two things that are a must for me is that the cookware has to be non-stick and has to be easy to clean up. So let's open this box and see what the skillets look like. They pack these nice and tight. I'm always checking out the packaging in products that I do reviews of because generally if they pack the product well, that's a good sign. That means they take time and they care about their products. So judging by the packing, this looks good. <laughs> Here is the 8-inch skillet, or frying pan as they call it, the 10-inch frying pan, and the 12-inch frying pan. I'm going to be focusing mostly on the 12-inch frying pan because that is the size of frying pan that I use all the time. So, this feels really nice. feels very sturdy. It's lightweight, but not flimsy lightweight. The handle doesn't feel like it's loose or shaking and gonna fall off if you try to pick it up with food in it. It feels durable, feels like it would last for a while. A while ago I did a review on Michelangelo's cookware and this cookware is definitely lighter than theirs but it doesn't seem like it's necessarily inferior to their cookware so that's always a personal preference how light or how heavy you like your skillets. The inside of it is very rough, it's not smooth like most non-stick pans are. It feels more like the inside of a cast iron skillet. So it feels really strong. And keep in mind, they don't use any chemical coatings on the inside. It's just supposed to be naturally non-stick. So it feels nice, looks nice, but most importantly, what does it cook like? So I'm just going to make a quick Southwestern scrambled egg recipe here. I am testing out the 12 inch skillet. Like I said, that's the size that I usually use, but really for this particular recipe, the eight inch skillet would be the perfect size for it because I'm just making a small recipe. But for the Southwestern scrambled eggs, place the skillet over medium low heat, add one tablespoon of butter and allow the butter to melt completely. While the butter's melting in a small bowl, whisk together two large eggs and a half tablespoon of sour cream. Whisk them together until everything is fully combined and the eggs are fully beaten. Then set the bowl aside for a minute. Place one to two chopped mini sweet peppers into your melted butter that's in your skillet, or frying pan as they call it. Stir the butter and the peppers together just to combine. Then allow the peppers to cook for about two to three minutes or just until the peppers are soft. 
Make sure as they are cooking that you stir them frequently so you can avoid the under parts of the peppers getting burnt. The one downside about these frying pans is they do not come with lids. I personally prefer my skillets, especially my large ones, to have lids for them. You don't need them for this particular recipe, but a lot of the recipes that I use my large skillet for need lids, but it's not a big deal. It's just my personal preference. Once your peppers are softened, then pour your egg mixture over the peppers. Add one to two tablespoons of salsa and stir the salsa and egg mixture together to fully combine. Sprinkle the mixture with some salt and pepper according to your personal taste. Then add one to two pieces of deli sliced ham that's been chopped to your desired size. You can also use bacon if you prefer to use cooked bacon. That's up to you. Stir everything together until it's fully combined. Now, so far, this skillet seems to be doing really nice. It's cooking well. The heat seems to be evenly distributed throughout the full pan and nothing seems to be sticking. So, so far, so good. Allow the eggs to cook until the eggs are fully set. Again, make sure as the eggs are cooking that you are frequently stirring them to avoid any burning. Once the eggs are fully cooked, spoon the mixture onto your desired plate. As you can see here, the eggs are not sticking at all. They're sliding right out of the skillet. You can serve these eggs immediately. If you want to, you can top them with some more cheese or salsa or anything you want. I like to actually put this in a tortilla and wrap it kind of like a breakfast burrito. That's all up to you. So overall, these skillets seem like a very good product. The eggs cooked really well. They did not stick or burn. The skillet was very easy to clean. They are dishwasher safe, but I just washed them by hand because I wanted to see if the food was going to easily come off washing by hand, and it did. All I did was hit it with hot soapy water, and before I even got the rag to it, the food was already sliding off no problem. So it cleaned very easily, very nicely. Also, one of the big pluses for this skillet is that it is oven safe. Other skillets that I've done reviews on and that I've tried out, they are not oven safe. And this one is because the inside of it is made with cast steel along with the aluminum. So you can use this in the oven or the stovetop. So that is a great big plus to this as compared to other skillets. So good product, thumbs up from me. Keep in mind the link to this product will be in the description as well as a 15% discount code. This discount code can be combined with any Amazon coupon or any sell that they may be having on their product. So I hope this was helpful to you. Make sure you click the subscribe button and as always, keep cooking.